Yo, how's it going guys? Rebel here, coming to you with a brand new video. And today I'm going to be showing you guys the gold pack method. It's finally back. It's really, really good. And I'm going to show you how I do it, how to properly do it so you make the most coins possible. So you pack some team of the seasons. But before we get into the video, go ahead and leave a like. Let's try to hit 100 likes on this video. I'm pretty sure we can. You guys have been killing it recently on that squad battles glitch video, on the crafting video, on the investments video, on everything. You guys are killing it. So uh, leave a like. Let's hit 100 likes on this uh, for a pizza party. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more FIFA 21 content. Content we upload every single day follow the stream on twitch if you want to see everything live uh after this video goes live we're actually going to be playing some uh squad battles i don't know what we're going to play but we need to get our icon swaps because i want to open the 84 times 20 so we're probably going to do that on stream today uh join the discord for more uh gold pack method tips are always helping each other in there it's actually kind of cool but uh enough of that let's get straight into it so what is basically the gold pack method the gold pack method is uh where well, you just open a gold pack right you open a gold pack just like a bronze pack let me demonstrate with the bronze pack the bronze pack method you guys know what it is you sell everything in there and you make coins that's the same exact thing for the gold pack method i've been doing this uh since like fifa 2020 yeah like since fifa 20 since last fifa uh are we in fifa 21 or 22 we're in fifa 21 right yeah since fifa 20 then um so you know you just you just sell everything in there and you make profit but uh this pack method is really really good because of one thing right now and that is because of the la liga upgrades so as you guys know the la liga where is it if i'm even gonna find it even the 81 doubles the uh la liga premium upgrades and the la liga upgrades they all require uh the la liga premium requires 11 rares because just gold rares that causes the prices of gold rares to go up and they're currently like at an all-time high they're actually like at 1.4k which is really really high and the gold commons are sitting at around 800k. You could check this on the transfer market, uh, but that's a reason why the gold pack method right now is so good. So you go to transfer market, right? Uh, let's look at gold common. Go to, uh, it's probably like at 800 right now. They're settling like at 800, like most of them 800. So you can sell most of these for 800 coins. If you do get like a good uh, nation, a good uh, league, like an English center back in the Prem, they usually sell for like 950 to 1000. That's what I list them for. But as you guys see, once you list them for 850, they're not really selling instantly. So 800 is going to be the price that you're going to be selling the gold commons at right now. But if you do go ahead and take a look at gold rares, I think they're settling at 1300. Uh, yeah, they're setting like at Insta saw at 1300. Insta saw at 1300. Uh, so maybe you could even step it up a little bit at 1400. Once you start seeing the minutes winding down, so that's still Insta sells at 1400. Let's try 1500. Uh, that's still Insta sells at 1500. Let's try 1600. Um, 1600 it still sells because it's in this 59th minute uh 1700 is probably where it's going to die down yeah as you guys see right here the seconds 40 seconds 30 seconds whatever that's one that's a limit you can't list past that so you could but it won't sell instantly so 1600 is probably the minimum uh or the max price you're gonna be able to list them at and it's always important to make sure like you're checking the stuff as well and also gold rare contracts sell as well gold manager contracts sell as well player healing sell as well but the most two the other two important things that are really really good in this method is actually the chem styles okay so something like a shadow uh that sells for like 4k or i think three point something let's see a shadow sells for like a good amount yeah like a 3.5k for a shadow uh let me make sure 3.5 yeah it's like 3.5k for a shadow and for a hunter i do think it's a little bit less uh yeah hunter's like 2.5k but also the bigger ones bigger than chem styles are the position modifiers if you go to striker to center forward these currently sell for like 4.4 uh yeah right there 4.4 and then you got the cam to center mid that sells for if not extinct right now i don't know if it's extinct no it's not extinct or maybe it is hold on yeah the cam to center mid is currently extinct so if you do pack a camera center mid, you're making your money back on off of one card, just off of one card. There's a bunch of other ones, you know, you got your CDM to center mid that also sells as well. Um, I could go on and on and on and on about stuff that you could get from this. But from my knowledge, the best things that you're going to be wanting to look at is position modifiers, chem styles, and the actual players. Uh, of course, there's some other crowd chants like the Liverpool one, uh, the AC Milan one, the Borussia Dortmund one the real madrid one those sell for a lot of coins if you get the ac milan one it sells for 5k if you get black nets black paint black uh stadium seats you know those sell for a lot um just just stuff that looks really really good now we're gonna go ahead and take a look at my transfer list right here i have been doing gold pack method for about like 30 minutes and i have been like maybe in 20k profit which is really good i'm gonna clear it all right now and open a couple packs for you guys just so you guys see everything so otavio as you see 1500 
Uh, it fluctuates. They all fluctuate. So this dude was 2,000, the 1,400. The center max was 850, 800 for him. Um, even I could get 900 out of him, 850 out of him. I got 2K out of this dude right here. So you always want to compare the price as well. Um, let's see. I know there was one more that I sold for quite a bit. No? Okay, no, I sold a manager right there. I sold the contract. I sold a shadow for 3.1 more contracts. I sold a striker center forward for 4,300. Position modifiers again. Um, another striker center forward, a center mid to cam, another contract, and then the stadium seats, pink. I sold those. So I'm going to go ahead and clear the, the transfer list. Take a look at what I currently have here. Uh, we're going to list this guy for 800. Um, and then we're going to move on to the contracts or this AC Milan one that does sell for 5K. Um, I'm just going to keep listing it. I know it's going to sell. I just have to keep listing it. So I'm just going to keep, you know, relisting that. Uh, so now we're going to start actually doing it. I'm going to show you the whole process. I talked about it with you guys, how to actually, you know, how to do it, what sells, what doesn't sell. Um, and basically guys, the point of this method is obviously to make coins, but the point is to keep opening packs, keep breaking as even as possible. Uh, maybe losing a couple hundred coins, making a hundred coins here and there. But the point is to break as even as possible so that when you do hit a walkout, when you do hit a board, when you do hit a team of the season, you're just in the profit. You're just in the profit. You can sell it. And, you know, it's just, it's just a really good um, way to make coins. I've made a lot of coins like this throughout uh, the entire year, which is very, very good. And as you start doing this more often, you're going to start, like, noticing the prices. You're going to start remembering the prices uh, for certain players, for certain leagues. So I can tell you guys right now that none of these guys are probably going to sell for more than 850 maybe he's gonna sell for like 900 i doubt it though uh so we're gonna listen for like 850 he sh should sell right away uh Rigoni is not gonna sell he's gonna sell for like 800 because he's on a in a bad league and then wood right here is probably gonna sell for like 850 because he's from the prem that's what saves it uh the contracts i'm gonna send it to the club and quick sell them at the end but uh, as you guys saw, we made 2K back from that pack. We're 3K down. Uh, and I'm not stressing that much over it because we still have some players to sell. So let's go ahead and open that pack. This is actually a really good one. I know he sells for more than 1K for sure. I know he sells for more than 1K. And if you guys, the quiz, pop quiz time. What is the most valuable thing in this pack? Is it A, your rye? B, the Ecuador kit, or C, the camera center mid? You have three seconds to answer. Comment, comment down below real quick. Comment down below. Three, two, one. The correct answer was, what was it? Was it C, <laughs> C, camera center mid? Camera center mid. Camera center mid is, uh, like I said, guys, it's extinct. Sell it for 5K. I just made all my money back on this pack alone. So that's very, very nice. Um, And then I can sell the contract for 200 and then I have all these players to sell. So let's just think about it like, let's just think 3K profit off of this pack. That's a 3K that we lost on the other pack. So now we got that money back. Uh, I'm going to price check that guy because I know he sells for a lot. This guy's going to sell for 800. Uh, Blazikowski is going to sell for 800 as well. And then we got the right wing to right mid. Probably going to sell for like 500 in my opinion. Uh, yeah, probably like even less probably. Let's do it for like 400. Uh, there you go. Now we're going to take a look at your ride. Let's actually back out. Go to transfers, transfer market. Uh, Yarai. Yerimina, not Yerimina, bum. Yeah, like I told you guys, I knew this guy was going to sell for quite a bit just because athletic Bilbao center backs for some reason are kind of expensive. We're going to list this guy for 2.2K. Uh, and as you guys see, the camera center mid sold right away. This dude sold right away, right away, right away, and 1600 right away. Um, what was the price on this guy? I don't even remember. What was the price on him? 2.2, right? Yeah, 2.2. And if we do take a look, we're back where we started, right? We're back where we started already. We're back where we started. We still have this guy to sell for 2K. That's going to bring us to 210K. We got this, this, probably 212K at the end of this. So we're already 4K profit, which is very, very nice. I'm not going to clear the transfer list just yet. I'm going to show you guys everything. Um, Gold pack. Open another one. And the goal right here, like I said, is just to be making close to as many coins as possible back um you don't even have to make profit you just have to kind of break even so for the next pack if i do hit something crazy you know i'm already in the profit and i'm already gonna hit something crazy uh so saint Pauli, Pauli, i haven't even seen that one leon this probably sells for a couple like 200 coins uh kits do sell gold common kits do sell so you want to make sure that you are selling those gigit i know sells for a, oh wow wow he dropped it used to be a lot uh we'll listen for 950 I know he kind of sells like instantly. 
800 for him we will sell and then a fray will sell for 800 as well so there you go uh we'll quick sell that so this pack we're probably down like one or 2k which is not the best uh let's see if Yurai sold yet did he sell yet he did sell so that is a lot of coins back to be honest that counter center mid that's crazy that we hit it let's keep hitting those i have hit two counter center mids before in one pack which is kind of crazy um that's like the best case scenario for you guys a rare here can we get a walkout not a walkout i wish it was a walkout i wish it was a team of the season um okay nacho monreal we'll sell him for 1600 right off the bat we're gonna compare his price anyway uh let's go ahead and compare his price 2100 um 2600 you know for this guy if we don't see one for close to 1600 we're gonna listen for like 1700 so let me check his price real quick 2k dang so many pages of him he should be selling for like yeah we'll sell this dude for like 1700 we'll sell him for 1700 uh this guy's gonna sell for 800 instantly and then this guy should sell maybe for like 900 uh just because he's in a pretty good league yeah we'll sell him for 900 uh that's a good one right middle right wing again we'll sell for like 350 um gold stadium base paint sells for like 200 maybe and uh everything else we'll send to the club nice 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 uh let's keep ripping these open and hopefully we get something good soon uh but if you guys are doing this let me know what the best pool you guys have gotten is um so far in this time period not of all time of all time mine is probably like sala back when he was like 350k that was probably my best pool but uh for you guys let me know comment down below what your best pool is right now i'm interested in seeing some people tell me they get icons out of this some people tell me they get moments icons moments from Aldine, or moments uh fernando torres kind of crazy i don't know if i really believe it i need to see proof oh look at that perfect link america perfect link nice that's good I'll do 850 for him and we'll do 800 for him and we'll do 800 for him as well so we're probably losing like 2k on this pack as well which is not the best but you know hopefully we make it all back let's keep it going and that's how it is guys walk out hey we got a board can it be an 85 a tiago silva something like that spain left wing hey that's actually good that's like an 8k card um so this is what i'm talking about when you hit cards like these after breaking even for so long you're just gonna go either back up and break even or make even more profit to spend more money on packs which is very good and let's see if we get a good position modifier here if we do it's gonna be uh you know pretty good oh my god oh this is a pack that you want this is a pack that you want hold on i'm gonna tweet this actually this is the pack that you want um that's a crazy crazy pack um just just crazy best what uh gold pack what a gold pack perfect right there that's that's if you're not following the twitter what are you doing follow the twitter it's revo um but yeah as you guys like this is just crazy so we get this guy that's like eight seven k right maybe even ten seven k right there get the cabinet sentiment that's 5k that's already 12k back then you got one two three four five six players right there we're probably gonna make like 10 or 15k back on this pack which is kind of crazy um and then we get a kind of good manager right here not really we'll quick sell him huddersfield chant we'll quick sell that pistachio that's probably the ugliest one so we'll quick sell that and that and that so we're gonna list that for uh max price we're gonna send him to the transfer list because we gotta check his price we're gonna check all these little dudes right here uh probably we'll sell you for 950 we'll probably sell you for like 900 850 actually we'll do you for 850 uh we'll do you for 800 we'll do you for 800 as well we'll do you for 800 as well and then the last one's probably like 900 just because he's in the mate or 850 we'll do 850 uh but yeah wow that's that's a crazy pack those are the packs that you want to see so let's go back to oyer zabal uh and let's check his actual price oyer zabal 6.8 so 6.7k for this dude uh pretty good pack so 6.7k let's go back to him let's go find him bro i love that i have the series x it is ridiculously fast it is too fast 
uh and it's, it's just crazy it saves me so much time doing all this just going back and forth as you see switching boom 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 my other one would be lagging it would be lagging it would be crashing but as you guys see i sold the camera center mids already i sold uh quite a lot of other stuff i sold this dude for 900 900 um it just keeps selling you know um we still got one more card there and i think we just sold orizaba did we just sell him we just sold him so as you guys see from what we've opened like five six packs already and from where we started we were at 208k right we're already at 212k we still have like four more players to sell whoa no five no we have a lot of players to sell and uh, we got a lot of coins to spend so and we have all those contracts that we sent to our club so you know we're at 4k profit basically just opening packs um so now if we do actually hit something big rare again not a walkout. Another back-to-back -back board, though. Can we get another 84-85? Portugal. Center mid. Uh, is this an 83? This is an 83 John Moutinho, right? I'll take it. I'll take it. Probably like 3K again. Can we get another position modifier in this? Uh, We do get two position modifiers and three players, which is very, very good. Can we go ahead? Yeah, 3K for him. Uh, and as you start doing this, you're going to start remembering the prices for these players, which is very, very good. Uh, center forward is striker. I don't really know. You could check these on footbin, but I'm going to go ahead and send those to my thingy. Um, 800 for him. I know you're probably going to sell for like 900. So let's do you for 900 right now. And then this guy might actually sell for quite a bit. I don't know why Porto players are selling right now. We're going to sell you for 950. And then we're going to send that. Discard that. Boom. Uh, what was the stuff that we just got? We got center mid cam and center forward striker, right? So let's go ahead and check that out real quick. Center forward striker. This probably sells for like peanuts, to be honest. I don't think it's going to sell for much. Uh, 700, I'll take that. That's like another player, basically. So if you think about it like another player. Don't think of it as another position modifier. That's 800 coins we're going to get back for that. And then the center mid cam, we're going to get... Um, Center mid cam is probably not going to suffer much. Oh, well, this is basically like another, you know, board type of player. So 1700. And what was the other thing? 1700 and 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. 1700, 800. Oh, shoot. It was a wrong one. So I think this one's even better. Center mid CDM. No, that's probably worse. So let's go center mid CDM. Uh, let's go check it out. There you go. I thought this one would be kind of expensive, to be honest. Uh, but it's the other one. The other way around. CDM to center mid is very expensive. So think of this as well as another player. 850. You know, we're just we're just printing coins right now. Uh, not really printing coins, but, we, you know, we're making a, a decent amount of profit. Which, which, you know, any profit is always good profit. And as long as you're having fun doing this and it's not a hectic just constantly flipping them, in my opinion, it's a dub. Because if I was sitting here flipping like gold cards for like hours upon hours just to make like 100k, you know, you're making easy coins. Or you're not easy coins, you're making coins, but you know, you're wasting a lot of time not having fun doing it. So I think this is a very good method. You know, you never know what you're going to pack. You can pack anything. There's no limit to it. You can pack an icon. You can pack an inform. You can pack an, a team of the season. You can pack a, a gold rare Ronaldo. You can pack so many things um, off a gold pack method that is just, it's just crazy. It's fun. And it's a good thing to be doing, you know, just to be passing the time, especially right now. You guys should be taking advantage of it uh, since we got all these player picks and we got all these upgrades and stuff causing the price of them to actually rise and go up. Look at that little perfect link right there, by the way. Uh, you know, we never know when it's going to be another good time to be doing this. As you guys see, we're already 6K profit from where we actually started. Uh, let's keep doing this. Let's get another back to back to back board. Ah, oh, that's not a board. That's not even a gold, a rare. So let's go ahead and open this. Let's see if we get anything good in here. Maybe a nice chant. Oh my God, bro. If you're not doing this, what are you doing, bro? If you're not doing this, what are you doing? What are you doing? Shoot. You see, we're making too many coins. We get a little transfer ban right there. But if you're not doing this, what are you doing, man? What are you honestly doing? Because you're, you're, you're missing out on easy coins. Just passing the time, passing the time. And I know my time's going to come. I know I'm going to eventually hit something big. Uh, that's just how it works, man. That's just how it works when you're doing this. I know eventually I'm going to hit something crazy. What the heck is that? Is that the right way? Hopefully I don't get a ban. Uh, there you go. Perfect. Hit me up if you need to uh, verify your account. I'm super good with it. Look at that messy, dude. Look at that Suarez. Look at that PK that just came out. I'm doing that PK, by the way. But um, yeah, crazy, crazy. Uh, good to be doing this. We get 1K back. Okay. 
We get the striker to center forward that sells for 4k instantly. Uh, we get a left wing and left back that sells for nothing. We're going we're gonna to quick sell that. Actually, we're going to send the contracts there. Uh, we got these guys that sell for maybe for like 850 each. We'll do 900 for him. Uh, 850 probably for him. 800 for the dead league probably. And then we'll do 800 for him as well. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the striker center forward. I know it's like 4k for it, but just to double check, you know, you want to make as many coins as possible. You don't want to undersell anything. Uh, maybe that was a snipe. Maybe not. 4.2, 4.3. So no, they are selling for 4.2. So let's go ahead and list the striker center for forward for 4.2. I was going to list them for 4k as well. So I would have lost some nice coins there. So that's important to always check stuff that you think is valuable. Uh, this we're just gonna quick sell. I don't think many people are buying sparklers at the moment. Uh, let's see once it sells right here. It's good. Oh my god. So we got this. We're gonna be pushing like 220k. All these gar cards right here. Crowd chance. Jesus Christ, man. That, that's a lot of stuff that we're gonna be pushing. Um, and all the stuff that we've already sold. We've hit two boards, which is very good. We've hit like three camden center mids. As you can see, we're already at 220k. What did we start with? We started at 208k. So we're legit 12k profit right now, which is insane. And I haven't even hit like a big, you know, walkout. Crazy, guys. Crazy. What is this? Crazy, guys. Crazy profit. Uh, so this is the pack that you don't want to be getting. Oh, shoot. Shoot. I just, I accidentally just sent those to the club. Hold on. Let me go ahead and get them out. But those are not the stuff that you're going to want to be getting, okay? Those are not the packs you're going to want to be hitting. Uh, let me go ahead and see advanced filters acquire date newest These are not the ones you're gonna want to be hitting uh, Although I did get four players, which is basically 4k. I didn't get a big, uh, you know Position modifier a big chemistry style. I didn't get any coins back. I didn't get anything like that It's just straight-up players. So although players is good at times you want to be making sure that you're getting a uh, you know divert spreading out your uh your your stuff that you're getting into your pack okay you want to make sure that you're getting some good stuff sometimes so if you're getting all players um you know if you get one player that's like 3k that's really good but if they're all 800 coins and you only get three of them you know that's kind of dead so right here that guy's gonna sell for like 900 i already know um see another pack this one was even worse because we only get three players in this and we don't get a big position modifier we don't get anything else of that that much of value so this is kind of dead this is not a good pack again that you don't want to be seeing so we'll take the loss on that maybe like 2k loss on there and just like that we're back where we started at 208k we could have cashed out uh we get a rare though not a walkout not a board uh let's see what it is maybe a big league rare benitez okay we'll sell him for 1600 i know he does sell for 1600 instantly um let's go ahead and sell him uh, we got these dudes that are going to quick sell right there. We got this guy that could sell for like 850. And like I said, when they're dead leagues, I just sell them for 800. If they're big leagues, I sell them for like 850 or 900, depending on how I'm feeling. And we're very close to maxing, not maximizing our uh, transfer list right there. So let's go ahead and crack this open. Let's get a rare. Let's get a walkout. Not a rare. Uh, just a regular gold common. Let's take a look at how much he is or what we got. So this is a good one. I'll take this. This gold song uh, doesn't sell for anything. 1k back already. The Hawk sells for like 600. Uh, we'll do it for 250. And then the center forward is striker. How much is this again? I forgot. Whoa. I think that was like 800, right? I think it was like 800. So we'll sell that for 800. Uh, Clark does sell for quite a little bit. Oh, no, he doesn't. Wow. 900 for him. And our transfer list is full. So what are we going to do? We're going to go ahead and clear like one thing. If we can, can we actually clear one thing? No, we can't, huh? Do we have anything waiting in the transfer list that we could actually quick sell? No, we don't. Okay, so I'm going to give you guys a rundown of our transfer list, and then I'm going to list the remaining players, and I'm going to call it a day. So we hit five rares. Five rares out of, like, what, 10 packs? I didn't keep track, but, you know, they all sold for, like I said, 1,600 or above. Um, yeah, this guy being a goalie, he sold for the lowest. This guy being in a good position, 1,700. We got an 83 for 2,800, and we hit this guy for 6.7, which I think is pretty good. So that's like 13K off, or 14K off of gold rares by itself. We hit this guy for 2.2K. We hit a lot of gold comments that sold for 800, 850 to 900. Um, you know, like I said, the lower leagues, 800. The big leagues, 900. Which is, that's, a, that's a good example right there of how much they're actually going for. 
And then we hit these cams and center mids. We, we hit two of them. That's 10k. We hit these guys for 800. And then we hit this for striker center forward, which is really good. A center mid of CDM 850. Um, and they all pretty much sold. We got to sell this guy. Um, we got some contracts still to sell. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys our contracts at the end. And I'm going to go ahead and discard them just to, to show you guys a good amount. Uh, we got these nets that will sell. We got these players that will sell. Chemistry sellers that are going to sell. Um, yeah. But I'm going to go ahead and clear the transfer list right here. Just so I could sell the other things that are currently on our thingy. But like I said, guys, we are currently 2K profit, right? We started at 208K. We're at 210K. We have a lot of things left to sell. Um, so don't worry. We're going to make probably like 5, 6K profit on this entire video right here, which is pretty good. And we didn't even hit something big. So if we did hit like a crazy player, like a team, not even a crazy player. If we hit like a, like a Turkish uh, player, you know, we would have made walked away maybe like 20K, 30K. You never know. But as you guys see, we're at 210K. I'm going to go ahead and discard the contracts that we did actually get from this. So we're going to go consumables, uh, contracts, and it's going to be gold contracts. We're going to take a look at these. Uh, so we got 70 of them that we actually sent to our thingy. We could list them on the transfer market, which we might actually do. But if we didn't do that, I'm just going ahead and showing you guys what we'd actually make back. So we'd probably make like 10K back off of contracts alone. But what I'm going to probably do, guys, is just sell them during the weekend uh during the weekend league and hopefully make some uh you know decent coins uh maybe like 20k instead of 10k uh and then we got our manager leagues that oh, look how many manager leagues we have we have so many of these if we did eventually want to sell like our premier league ones how much do they even sell for uh 200k 200 coins yeah we have so many of these we could discard them uh make like 1k each we got a lot of healing cards as well that we could sell uh i'm just gonna go ahead and quick sell these actually i don't really want those uh, what else do we have? We have position modifiers. A lot, a lot, a lot of these. Um, canvas center forwards. Are these actually selling right now or no? No way these are selling for 5k. Yeah, no. I was about to say I'm going to be rich. But center forward to cam. Nope. Uh, left wing to left mid. Are these selling? It's always important to check them. Uh, you know what? Maybe we could sell this for like 900 right now. Uh, just because there's maybe some good left wings that need to be converted to left mid. Uh, anything else? We'll sell these for like 800. Just keep listing them. And right wing or right mid. We know this sells for like 450. Um, let's keep selling. You know, it's it's always important just to be ch keep checking everything in your club. Oh, this actually sells for a lot. I didn't even know we had this. So we're going to put this on the transfer list. Hold on. Place on transfer list. We got the stri center forward striker is going to be selling for, like we said, 800. Um, this one is untradeable. Center forward striker. Let's go ahead and check out our transfer list real quick. I know we have a CDM to center mid, right? CDM to center mid. Yeah, CDM to center mid is going to sell for like three point something. Um, and we got that and we didn't even know we had that. So that's pretty cool. We saved it from the last time uh, when they weren't really that expensive. So that's kind of smart if you want to do that. If something isn't expensive right now, like the left wing to left mid is not really that expensive. Sometimes they hit like 2K. So if you want to wait a little bit and you want to not sell them right away that is something you could do probably invest them in them too so let's do 3.5k for that <clears throat> 3.5k and there you go just like that we're going to be a 10k profit from where we actually started so that's the video guys i know it's a little bit of a long video but if you enjoyed it please leave a like like i said let's hit 100, let's hit 100 likes uh, comment down below what your best pool is if it's actually working for you Don't forget to subscribe for more FIFA 21 content like this. I love doing videos like this I love doing gold pack method video whenever it's available um, I was just you know, it was available for, for like two days since Sunday But I've been waiting off until the prices have been hitting a good high a decent high And I think right now is a good time position modifiers especially are kind of inflated They are currently selling for a lot. So as you guys see we're hitting 220k we're uh, probably 12k profit from this little pack opening, but thank you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your day. I'll see you guys next time, and good luck grinding, good luck on opening packs. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.